No, Kevin, you can't say that. What's wrong? Oh, hello, fellow Jealous. Welcome to the Late Night Early Show. I'm your host, Ron Sturgeon B. Here's your co-host, Kevin Chicken. <laughs> well, we got a great show for you tonight. First of all, we are going to learn how to make the perfect pancakes with our guest star, Gary. <laughs> yeah, go on up there, Gary. Wait, wait, what? Go on and make some pancakes. But I don't know how to make pancakes. Go, go, go ahead, try it. I only know how to make sandwiches. Make the damn pancakes, Gary. Fine. Okay, so first things you're gonna need, you're gonna need a bowl, whatever this thing is, and the knockoff of a knockoff, Gary Coleman griddle. So first thing you're gonna do, you're gonna get your pancake mix. Now, really it doesn't matter how much you put on, nothing really matters ever, especially in my life. Secondly, what you're gonna do, is you're gonna to wanna to get some water. Now, this is probably the most important part of the whole entire thing, is that you wanna make sure you put enough water in there. If not, it'll turn out dry. A lot like this show. Next, what you're gonna to to do is you wanna start mixing. You know, pancakes are, uh, they're a very important meal. They get used to celebrate many events, much like birthdays, anniversaries, funerals, Basically anything. Mix it. Mix it good. Gary. Oh, oh, sorry. So next thing what you want to do is you want to pour it onto your hot griddle. Now, usually we make about three to four inches. We'll try. Yeah, make it pancake. Okay, now is one of the biggest parts. You wait. Okay, that's good enough. Now what you gotta do is you gotta flip them over. Make sure that both sides are brown. Those look like shit, Gary. Get the, get the ones from the other table. Under the table? Yeah, yeah, right under there. What the? Yeah! Wow! Those are some dead good looking pancakes. Wow. Well, anyways, on a more serious note, we are our, our next guest is a local band from here in Pacific, Kansas, the James Pitts Band. They're going to be broadcasting live from their studio, so we'll go on and head, head over to them. One, four, five. <laughs>
That was pretty awesome. I really like those guitar solos. Uh, on to our next guest. You all, know him, lo you all know him and love him. He's not the sharpest tool in the shed, but he's definitely the hardest. The star of Crowbar Origins, Crowbar. Thank you, thank you. It's a pleasure to be here. So, Crowbar, you have a new movie coming out, is that correct? Yes, yes, it's called Crowbar. It's History Origins 2. It's what I find my true love. Huh, interesting. I wonder what that's about. Well, if you shut up a moment, I'll tell you. I don't want to say too much, so I'll keep it brief. Did you say brief? That's the word of the day! Whoa! Yeah! Oh, it's for you, kid! You're gonna keep that! Yeah, you! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, I love that kid. Uh, anyway, uh, uh, what were we talking about again? Uh, when, when is your movie come out? It comes out April. Well, that's, uh, that's it for us tonight, folks. Uh, our fellow Jellos, that's all actually, I guess. Uh, thank you for the great show. Uh, it's been a great audience and great crew, honestly. Uh, Kevin's been a great co-host. Not saying too much, but, I mean, hey, I'm saying everything. Gary was a really good uh, cook for us for once. We never had him on here before. Oh, uh, what? what's going on? Kevin? Kevin! Where'd you go, Kevin? What's going on? What hap what's happening? Kevin, what are you doing? Kevin! Kevin, you know I'm scared of the dark. Please!